I'm very quickly going to remind you of the five data quality management principles we included in the data quality framework. And you may have seen these on the video as we were warming up. These are the five principles to help you establish a strong data quality culture. Starting at, starting at the top left there, commit to data quality. Know your users and their needs. Assess quality throughout the data life cycle. Communicate data quality clearly and effectively and anticipate changes forthcoming uh, to your data quality that might affect you in, in the future. And to support these principles, we're going to be developing a data maturity model to help you to assess how well you are doing with data quality. OK, on the next slide, um, we define quality, as I'm sure you know, in terms of fitness for purpose, um, how the data are going to be used. Um, and we consider the six dimensions of data quality from the Data Management Association, Dharma. So these are completeness, how much of the necess necessary data are present, validity, are the values in valid ranges, as you'd expect them to be, consistency, are the data consistent between systems, between data sets, accuracy, do the data values reflect the real world, uniqueness, do duplicate entries exist, or is there dead, wo dead wood in the data? and timeliness. Are the data available at the time needed? OK, and on the final slide here, um, we now move on to our four conversations. Um, after those four conversations, we'll be um, having a round table session and a Q&A, so the opportunity for you to put your questions to the speakers. So rather than putting those questions in the chat, um, we'll be collecting questions through Slido as we go along. The Slido code, you can see the Slido URL there. Um, it's pretty self-evident when you log in. And the Slido code there is DQHub1301. So Data Quality Hub, DQHub, and today's date, 1301. Um, if we don't get around to answering all the questions during the session, uh, we will respond to them after the event. And just a reminder there uh, that the, this event is being recorded. Um, and the recording will be on YouTube. So um, we regard remaining on this call as being considered approval for that recording. And if you aren't contributing, um, if you're not speaking, uh, can you turn off your cameras just in case we inadvertently record you? OK, that's my bit done. So now I get to hand over to our first guest, Teresa Ashworth and uh, Rebecca. <laughs> 